Hi, I'm Construction Gamer, and this is another UK mod showcase for Transport Fever 2. Uh, this is episode what number episode number eight now, and we've got uh, a few trains, and we've got some new buses to look at as well. Should start with an apology to Funclive and Pocket. Funclive was responsible for the Class 90 reskin Mega Pack, uh, all but the GNER liveried version which was by pocket so yeah apologies to them for not mentioning them for their great work with the uh, the reskins for the class 90s which we're looking at now you can see there's a whole huge variety of different liveries there available a lot of work has gone into those so yeah there we are the mega reskin pack by fun clive and the gner logo um, one which we haven't actually got on this consist is by pocket uh, I think the next thing we will look at is some buses. We do have these have been, I think they've possibly been remodeled, uh, ported over and redone from Transport Fever 1. So these are the Enviro 500s, double decker buses. Uh, this one is in the Blue Star, and you just saw a Southern Vectis one go off there. Yeah, so it's a double decker bus, high capacity bus there with uh, three axle bus <laughs> what more can I say we'll look at that one then you will if you play transport fever one you'll recognize these and they've uh, the good high capacity buses I'm not familiar with really three axle double decker buses up where I am but uh, yeah these obviously operate down somewhere down south I think by the Southern Vectis uh, name probably gives that away so you've got that one there and then head over to either the town I've got the other um, variants as well there's some Arriva well I think they're all Arriva but they're just different variants so you've got the Vectis blue there and then there should be another one somewhere yeah I've got more I think I'm pretty sure Let's have a closer look. This should be an Arriva Unilink. Yeah, it looks it does look like an Arriva sort of colour. Possibly I might be wrong, but there we are. There. Some new buses. Do I have a vehicle depot? I think I do. So we've got there the Enviro 500 and then we've got the different variants there. They've got a capacity of 45. So let's look at one of the bendy buses. Pass actually passenger, that's probably easier. So that's 27 for a bendy bus, but I would I would reckon that should be about right because it's, it's a, it is a large high capacity bus. Um, they are available in the green from 2002 and in the blue from uh, 2003. So there we are. We've got a couple more buses to add to the uh, the Plaxton pointers that we already have. I think the next thing we want to look at is we've got two for the price of one on this on this consist. We've got some generic 060 locomotives here. Um, ooh, almost forgot the, Env <laughs> the Enviro 400s by Mad Hatter before I forget. I, I, I write these notes and I don't pay any attention to them. So yeah, the Enviro 500s by Mad Hatter and these um, 060 generic locomotives by Steve M4 comes in a variety of different colours these should be available from 19, uh, 1868 to 1930 and these locomotives are pulling these which are GWR van wagons um, by JK it's just these are kind of early wagons which transport a variety of different goods uh, there are obviously as you can see there there are different varieties so they're available from about 1850 through to 1948 in the uh, various configurations if we head into the depot we'll have a look at the locomotive first so we've got steam locomotives and it is a G somewhere generic 060 so it's 507 horsepower and 55 kilonewtons of track to effort they are early locomotives so that uh, that is about right so yeah, you got the different varieties 
in there and then if we look at the wagons we've got the cargo wagons and we do have here you can see these transport plastics mechanics tools and food that one takes grain as well yeah you've just got your different your different varieties there of GWR wagons so yeah they are pretty good uh, what else have we got to look at we do have something else which is around here somewhere it's not that where is it it is not that <laughs> we have not that it is the HYA wagons by CW315 these are coal hopper wagons which people will be familiar with uh, on the uh, British Rail Network high capacity wagons with uh, I think they dump from the bottom don't they as they come into say a power station or something like that so you've got a generic kind of unpainted one there you've got an EWS there and then you've got a GB rail freight on the back I think they only transport coal currently but we will double check in the uh, in the depot just have a bit of a look at these these you know the level of detail all the different stickers and things like that all the different warning stickers really nicely detailed let's take a look at the depot and then you've got cargo again and they are BH around here somewhere yeah so top speed 100 miles per hour capacity of 15 let's take a look at a gondola 18 yeah so it's about right yeah just coal on these but they do have a higher much higher speed than the standard kind of gondola so yeah loading speed 2 emission 63 and there you've got your three different variations there so yeah there's the mods that I've got today I'm not fully caught up because there are lots of other mods but uh, yeah these are the main ones that I wanted to look at and catch up on uh, especially the buses because it's good to see another bus another UK bus for the game but I think I will leave you with I'll leave you with this rake here I was going to wrap the video up there, but then on Saturday uh, the Class 68 was finally dropped on the Steam Workshop, so I couldn't resist having it featured in this episode. I'd already pre-recorded most of it, so I'm just adding this onto the end because uh, yeah, it needs needs highlighting, I think, because it is such a good mod. I think a lot of people have been eagerly awaiting this for quite a few weeks now. There's been a few sneak peek pictures of it and things like that, so. We have this uh, Class 68 in the DRS colours, direct rail services. Uh, this would be pull-in, kind of intermodal container freight type things. The model and well, the model itself is a collaboration between C Double Three One Five and Mr. Transport Guy. They've been working together on this um, on this mod. The DRS version should be available in about 2007, 17 rather, 2017 and the Transpennine Express should be 2018-2019 uh, it's not released yet but they are working on a Transpennine Express I think a Caledonian Sleeper as well and they are working on a uh, rake on Mark 5 carriages so you will be able to recreate that Transpennine Express loco hauled service, service that they operate with the Class 68 but for now we've just got the DRS version to appreciate I put the wrong cars on the back there on carriages I thought I'd put the container carriages but I put state cars but yeah the main feature is the train I'm just gonna shut up for a minute while you hear this uh, engine roaring because it I do like the way the 68 sound in real life and I think it's pretty good uh, sound in game as well so I'm just gonna shut up for a minute and I'll probably sign off and just leave you with the sound of the 68 purring so I'm gonna say until next time bye bye